Mass News. I'm Ruby. I'm Todd. And I'm Danny. Oh, this week's cool tool is integrity. For more on that, let's go to Alyssa. Integrity is a big word. Sure, it only has nine letters, but it means so much. Integrity is knowing wrong from right. Integrity is truthfulness and honesty. Integrity is something we deal with every day. Let's see some examples of integrity with Captain Underdahl. In everyday struggles of middle school students, he hears your problems and helps you make the right decision. It's Captain Underdahl. One day last week, Captain Underdahl was minding his own business until all of a sudden... What is this? I feel a student at HMS is in a crisis of integrity. I better go check it out. Money. No, I'm sorry. Do you have lunch money? Yeah, I have $10 that my grandma gave me. Are you sure you didn't do better than when you picked mine off before? I might have. Well, then that's my lunch money. No, I think that's mine. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's mine. How would you like it if someone took your $10 of lunch money? Mm. Okay. Well, here you go. I'm sorry. If you witnessed somebody stealing somebody else's lunch money, what would you do? Well, I would, I would probably go tell the principal or the teacher or somebody so they can probably go get their money back so they can go eat. Corey, if you found the $20 bill in the hallway, would you keep it in or turn it into the main office? I'd probably turn it in. Way to do the right thing. Okay. and another student was cheating off you, what would you do? Um, I'd probably um, just raise my hand and get the teacher's attention and tell on them for passing me the answers. Yeah. Instead of just trying to give you answers to a test, what would you do? Um, probably, probably take it and throw it away. Um, uh, I would probably just whack it back at their desk because I don't need answers because I get ace all my tests. <laughs> yeah. Hey! Zach, if you were taking a test and another student passed the answers, what would you do? Well, I obviously studied for the test the night before and I wouldn't really need the answers, so I'd just give it back to them and be like, why didn't you, why are you passing me the answers? And then I'd just, I'd just get into this whole conversation and then the teacher would probably be like, why are you talking, you're cheating, and then I'd eventually get in trouble, so, yeah. All right. Here she comes. Here she comes. Okay, you ready? Can we do something about that? Um, maybe she can take care of it herself. Hey! How would you like it if they were doing that to you and somebody just walked by? Alright, we should help her. Hey, knock it off. Yeah, just leave her alone. Whatever, let's go. Let's go, we don't need this. <laughs> Another job, well done! What would you do, Savannah, if you saw some students bullying another kid and they were laughing at him? Would you laugh along or go tell someone? I would probably go tell someone so that they could stop bullying the other kid. That's good. Ashley and Suzanne, what would you do if you saw students bullying another kid and laughing at him? What would would you laugh along or tell another teacher or tell a teacher? I'd go tell a teacher. Ashley, what would you do? I'd probably just make them stop, but not tell a teacher or laugh. That's good. Thank you, Captain Underdog, for saving the day once again. You know, it, you look a lot like Captain Underdog. You know that, right? Um, what? Uh, um, no, uh, now I'm a word from our sponsors. I was shopping for a new shirt. Which one's me? A CF1 or a Lungs for Lea C? Too bad I didn't know what CF meant, so I need a little help from us and the friends. L I S S Y spells Lea C. Doing our best to raise money. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious! Gotta raise money for cystic fibrosis! 
I was walking in school, hanging out with my friends, thought about some pencils. Thought about some pencils. I want to make a difference, but I don't know how. They can sell me a bear. Or even a cow. Green tail lemurs. We got notebooks and folders and grippies, too. You could even buy a dollar bracelet or two. Supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Gotta raise money for cystic fibrosis. No matter what I buy, I'll make a difference every time. Come on down to the Brick Breaks, next to the bathrooms on Corner Brick Boulevard and Creative Court, upstairs in the cafe. Wow, I didn't know I had so much stuff at the Bricky Biz. And to think the money you spend there goes to help tens of thousands of people all over the world. Yeah, they also have ping pong balls. What are you doing? Speaking of ping pong, let's go to sports with Brittany and Jordan. Welcome to HMS Sports, I'm Jordan. I'm Brittany. Today the wrestling team will be wrestling at Wilbur Wright Middle School at 5 p.m. Tuesday, the 16th, 7th grade boys basketball game will have a game against Taft at 4.30. 8th grade has a game at Taft at 5 o'clock. 